guys welcome back to a video yeah you have this car all right so as you can see i'm not in my car and i have a story to tell you guys that happened but how do you guys like my new wig i don't know if i'm on the verge of being ratchet or i look good i decided to like wear like a different hair color length everything because you know Sometimes, you know, you just want to be a different This car is no annoying me. All right, so I have a story to tell you guys. Um, by the way, I'm going to, I'm going to, um, oh, I forgot what that place is called. Well, there's a place in DC that, um, that they sell like huge pizzas and I really, really, really want one. So I'm going to go to DC with Franklin and Carlili. Unfortunately, Maddie can't come because, um, She's doing some family things, but um, it's okay. But yeah, I'm with Aiden. Aiden, did you miss everyone? All right, so story time for everyone. Okay, so the reason why I'm not in my car. All right, so like two weeks ago, uh, it was like, it was, it was a Tuesday or Monday morning, right? I was getting ready to go to work. Everything was going so good. You know, I was I was ready for work and I was with Aiden and I um, and I get my keys. I open my front door and then I see this. Yeah, I was so mad, bruh. Like you don't understand. And then and it's weird because in my neighborhood, shit. It's weird because in my neighborhood, like things like this don't even happen. This was so random and like for um for like someone to jack my wheels and rims and everything and leave them on a block like it was it was just like i was i was so traumatized like i was so mad but yeah my car is getting like completely fixed like it wasn't really broken or anything but like when they use a block to like lift it or whatever it had dented the side bumpers so obviously my car is new and me being like the way i am i wanted everything to be go back to how it was because yeah but thank god for car insurance and everything because that would have been so like that would have blew me even more if i had to pay for it um but yeah so that's the story of what happened to my car and why i'm in this rental car for the moment my car should be finished um, by Monday and it's Saturday right now. So yeah, story time. <laughs> Jackie, and I left it there. Oh, <laughs> Hi Franklin! So where are we going? Cause I forgot the name of that place and I was trying to tell my subscribers. Oh, we're going to Ducini's. It's like, no, it's called Ducini's. No, but the other name. That's the name of it, Ducini's. Pizza. No. What other name? You said it was called something else. No, it's called Ducini's Pizza. I call it Ducini's. No, uh, what is that place that people eat pizza like really late when they're drunk? Ducini's. That's not it, That's Frank. The place. That's not it. It's I swear. It's in Adams Morgan. How about you? You want to bet on? No, it's called Ducini's. You want to bet on this? It's called. Something See, I like how you say my word now. <laughs> no, it's, it's not. It's, it's something. It's something else. Ducini's Pizza. No, it's. Franklin, it's called what's the other what's the other pizza place? Jumbo Slice. Jumbo Slice, that's the place. That's not what. That's not where I go. Okay, whatever then. You do me a favor and text her Lily that um, that we're on our way to her house. Bitch. I know, sorry. Where's Elvin? He's going to the gym. Uh, yeah, I should have gone. <laughs> so we're here um, at the uh, Jumbo Slice. There. What kind? What kind of flavor do you want, Aiden? I want really cheesy, no tomatoes. No, the the sauce has tomatoes in it. Which one are you getting? I uh, have uh, the Jumbo Slice pepperoni. 
You like pineapple on pizza? No. You never had pineapple on your pizza? That's literally illegal. What do you like, man? Um, can I get a jumbo slice with um, sausage and pepperoni? Sausage pepperoni? Yeah. Sure. Which is pizza for some? Anything else? Uh, and ranch. Ranch dressing? Yeah, ranch dressing. And I was saying, if y'all don't like ranch on pizza, then... So like... Give me sausage! Then you guys are not living. That's mine. That's mine. This one's yours. Oh. <laughs> this is for you and me, Aiden. It's big as hell. Pineapple? Aiden, it's for me, bro. Mm -hmm. Okay. Something like this. Okay. Are you serious? <laughs> Alright guys, so it's like Alright, so it's like midnight right now um, I had filmed this whole video but then <laughs> my camera like erased everything so I have to like redo it but it's okay because I'm not even tired. So I went to um, this thrift store in my area um, called Unique and I've been there only once. And this was a couple years ago but I didn't know like how to thrift or like anything. So this time I had a kind of a good idea of what I wanted to buy. Actually no I didn't but like I had an idea of how to thrift. Um, but yeah like somebody had told me that when you're like thrifting you need to like literally go through every single piece of clothing so that's what I did and I actually did find a couple of things so I hope you guys enjoy it Aiden is sleeping back there so I'm talking really really low by the way guys happy new year I'm so sorry I've been like the usual crap I always tell you guys my camera was broken so yeah, I had to get it fixed. It took like almost three weeks to fix it. So I'm gonna start by showing you guys like the bottoms first, like the things I found like pants wise. So yeah, first piece of clothing I got was this. And by the way, I'm showing you guys the activewear. So this is um, a windbreaker sweatpants, um, New Balance. I believe this was $4.99. I love the material it's like it's like very thick but at the same time it's not that heavy it has a black lining on the side of the pants um, and it fits me pretty good it's not too tight and it's not too loose the second uh, windbreaker pants that I bought was this one I really really like this one because of the design on the side and this is um, E6 as well um, yeah it's just like that one just a different brand and color it's like a burgundy, reddish color, the inside is mesh, so yeah, it's found these in the men's section. So the next pants that I got were, um, were these pants, um, definitely for work, if you work in an office, um, these are Ann Taylor. These are a, a bit of a, a loose fit on me. Um, but they're really nice. They're dark gray, very plain. You can wear these with heels, flats, boots. Um, yeah, really nice. They're business casual. The next um, work pants that I bought for work um, are these. These are a bit more up dress kind of pants. Um, these are a bit of a tighter fit on me. I really like how they fit my my junk junk. These are from a brand called Rampage. I've never heard of that brand, but yeah. They're also boot cut at the bottom, just like the other ones. So yeah, these are those. Really cute. And they have like a little black lining all throughout the, uh, the design. Hopefully my brother doesn't hear me. So the next pair of pants that I got are so freaking cute. Oh my god, when I saw them, I was like, mine, be. These are from a brand called Riser. I don't know if any of you guys ever heard of this brand. I love the design. It's like a plaid, um, 
kind of look boot cut at the bottom I really don't know how I'd wear this this but um yeah it's really cute I really like it. it fits me perfectly like a glove so moving on to shirts the first shirt that I that I'm showing you in the video is this army shirt it's like a shirt that you can wear on bum days I've wore this in the vlog before this video I um, yes, I like this shirt it's really nice I can wear it to sleep I can wear it to go out dress casual streetwear yeah go army I bought this shirt this shirt was originally like this long but I had cropped it because I thought it looked cuter that way I got this in the men's section and um, I really like this shirt it's like really bummy but at the same time it's like really cute um, let's put on some bands some black jeans yeah it's really cute i really like it this is from a brand called st john's bay and it's a large in men's okay so i kind of went like overboard on all the turtlenecks so i'm just going to put like a montage of them right now they're all the same kind of brand I mean, they're all the same kind of material. They're like a very like bumpy um, kind of like feel to it. Um, all turtlenecks. I love how they look um, when they're tucked into my pants. As you can see in these clips, they're like so cute, and I can wear them to work um, as well. Um, make me look very sophisticated. Make me feel like more up dressy i think about like five or six of them yeah so these are the turtlenecks um i think they ranged from four dollars to eight dollars so i got a really good deal on the next shirt i got that's not a turtleneck it's um like a oh, i forgot what this material love how it has like a v right there this is from a brand called morona it's really cute i love how i dressed it I um, feel like it'll look cute with those pink pants and I pink shorts that I had on. Um, but yeah, it's, it's really nice. I like it. I love the material. The next piece of clothing is um, this blazer that I wore on top of that black shirt. I love this blazer. It's so cute. It was like $13 and it's from a brand called Requirement oversized you could put it over your shoulder you could put it on i wore this to church today actually not the fit that i'm wearing in this video but i put this on with like pants and stuff i really like it only the only issue with this is that you need to um take care of it because it gets really linty but you know it's not a problem if you just like maintain it and stuff but yeah almost done um so i got two coats the first coat is a trench a black trench coat and it's it looks like this this is from a brand called croft and borrow it's really nice for like on a rainy day or something um, it has all its buttons which i was very surprised about because usually like trench coats have like missing buttons on it but yeah this was i think this was nine dollars so i was like yeah that's mine i'm gonna take that thank you very much I really like this coat, it's really cute. So, the last coat I got, this coat is like so freaking cute. I love the material and bitch. Bitch. I really like the inside because it's like nude. The colors will blew me away. It's like a minty like Tiffany blue almost color. I love with this coat, it's really cute. And it has its belt as well. So yeah, thanks for watching my video. Hope you guys like this. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Um, here's my social media. And okay, but yeah, my battery's gonna die. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.